When you have a huge carnivorous plant collection, like we do, sometimes you lose things. And it's an old collection too. So I have these memories of plants that I saw when I was like 16 or 17 years old. And I go, where did that go? Uh, and this is one of those plants. This huge leucophylla has been here in the collection at California Carnivores my entire life. And I always remembered it for being so beautiful. There's something so special about these huge pitchers. It doesn't have any location data, but it almost looks like a Washington County to me, but it's like on steroids. So huge, very white, with this very um, spaced out uh, pink venation, and there's just something kind of butterfly looking about it to me. But I remembered this plant from when I was a teenager at Calcarn, and then I started back in 06, and I was like, where is that plant? And I was looking for it and looking for it, and we had this huge luke in this big wine barrel, um, for years, kind of tucked up against the roses and not quite enough sun. Meanwhile, I'm looking for this Luke. Where is it? Where is it? Meanwhile, I'm abusing it in the shade. And when we moved, I got it out from underneath that rose bush and we brought it out here in the full sun. And all of a sudden, it popped up these huge autumnal pitchers after making pitchers like this for years. And you can see, oh God, you wouldn't recognize that as something special. Sometimes they make something like that. But isn't that amazing how different that can look from between that? And that, and all of a sudden it totally transformed into that leucophila that I've been looking for for 30 years. So beautiful. And then another thing to see is that as it gets cold here, it's been blushing like, um, the lip has been blushing like hot pink. Such a beautiful plant. And now that I found it, I can't wait to integrate it back into our, our uh, crossing to make beautiful leucophilas with it. Wow, I was just watching the same video that you guys just watched. And Daniela just told me that that was actually from October of 2023. I always say everything I do takes forever, but it's well worthwhile. So it's taken us, I mean, we've had this plant, I think for like almost 40 years. And finally we found it again, you know, it was lost, but here it is in all its splendor, finally with a cultivar name, White Wedding, which I think you guys are going to super love. I always hear, you know, White Wedding in my head. And I'm sure Tiffany will be singing that every time she pulls one. Anyways, uh, years to fruition to get this into your collection. What a fantastic plant.